So you want to create an effective content strategy and you just don't know where to start. And a lot of businesses are scared by that and I can totally understand why. I hate strategy, it's not my thing. The way I talk to people and the advice that I give to people is that if you start with your overall content strategy, you need to have an idea about over the course of the year, what it is that you want to talk about, what's, what quarter you want to talk about different topics that are relevant to your customers and then break that down into months and themes for the month right and a lot of people struggle to then tie up their content on a weekly basis and a daily basis with that overall theme it feels like you're trying to extract a lot from that one theme and by the time you get halfway through the month you're really struggling for ideas if you get halfway through the month by driving with a video first strategy what that means is at the beginning of each month or the month before in advance you record a video of you talking passionately about that entire theme and you might have bullet points in front of you right but not scripted just a general conversation about that theme and getting your thoughts and ideas down about what you think of it what your opinions are your expertise some examples of things that you've seen in that area that have worked or haven't worked all those sorts of things there's lots and lots of different ways you can do that but getting that video done first means you can then take that video and turn that into all the content for the rest of the month. So you release the full video, you can chop it into clips. The clips can be repurposed for TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, wherever you wanna go. You can do them in landscape, square, portrait. You can do them as audiograms. You can do them as quotes. You can do, you can create a newsletter from it. That's what I do for my newsletter now, is we create a five minute video and we create the newsletter on the back of that. The AI has something to build things from and then I finesse the newsletter. It takes half the time, not even that. There are a million and one different ways you can use that video content if you create it first. And actually the beauty of doing it is it just feels like a really nice, normal conversation. So if you haven't tried it yet, give it a go. Even if you don't use the video itself, ironically, you can create some fantastic content and some great outputs just from doing that. And if you want to find out more about how to do that from a video, you want to find out, son? No problem. If you want to find out more about how to do that, we've got a webinar coming up at the end of the month. I will share the link in the comments. See you soon.